Hey guys, Grant here. Uh, I want to tell you a little bit about my buddy Ray Bonato. Is that good? You want to get a bite to eat after this? I'm busy. Oh. Do you find me attractive? Uh. Mm, I I'll not comment on that. <laughs> okay, That's fair enough. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, I first met Ray a couple of years back at the shop when he brought in his uh, resin to show us. He's, he's a surfer, has a passion for exploring the green bio-based materials, and he's also a PhD in chemistry. So he created this resin as an alternative um, for epoxy resins, an industry that uses mostly harmful materials. And what we saw was something pretty cool, so we figured we'd go to his factory in Gardena and just ask him some questions, snoop around, and have some fun. So here it is. Let's go. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? Uh, I'm here with Ray now, the uh, chemist, creator, mastermind behind Entropy Resins. Welcome, Ray. How you doing, man? Good. Thanks. Is that right? Are you the mastermind? I am the mastermind. <laughs> the wizard? Uh, I have a partner, my brother, actually. He's, right. uh, he's a material scientist and I'm a biochemist, so maybe there's two wizards. <laughs> wow. You guys sound like complete nerds. That's good. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's great. Okay, so some common thoughts about bio-based epoxies sure. are that they fall apart, they yellow, they're not as strong. The myth isn't entirely false in that, yeah, sure, bio -based, some bio-based materials can fall apart, just like also some petroleum-based materials can fall apart. It's all about how you engineer the materials to perform at the end of the day. So when we started Entropy, we set out to actually make a performance-based resin that could hold up to the, to the strains and stresses of things like surfboards or other composites. Um, and so we wanted to make something that was strong and environmentally friendly at the same time. And that's what we did, and that's what we have. And that's what entropy resins are. They're performance-based, sustainable resins. All right, so in my hand right now, I hold some of the Super Sap 100 epoxy surf resin, right? This is the clear resin. Um, so that's people, resin. that's the clear <laughs> resin in his hand. You want me to do it again? Uh, SuperSap Clear Epoxy was developed for applications where people wanted low color and good yellowing resistance. Uh, epoxies tend to yellow and most epoxies will yellow over time no matter what people tell you. So if you're looking at environmental benefits, there's two that go with all of our resins. One is bio-based content and then the second is carbon footprint. What are some of the, the materials that are in here when you say that it's 30% bio-based? Mm -hmm basically pine pulp, um, and then the second are, are basically all sorts of plants that go into the biofuels processing. These are like vegetables and, and other seeds that go So I can eat this then, it's vegetables. You My can't. parents told me to eat vegetables. <laughs> uh, we don't advise our customers to eat the resin, no. Um, so yeah, did that answer the question? So don't eat. Don't eat it, no. Okay, after you said feedstock, I kind of like drifted <laughs> okay. off and got hungry. Okay. So. Why should someone use this epoxy resin as opposed to the many that are out there? Uh, our Super Sap Clear resin has some really nice UV inhibitors in it and it's really easy to use and fast working. So it, it works just like any standard uh, epoxy resin, but it d does have the carbon footprint savings so they could feel good about themselves at the end of the day. Mm. What, right. uh, from a cost standpoint, what? It's okay. about it's the same. Yeah. So, oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> it's, it's the same. Oh. We're the same price. We're the standard standard price for, or we're the same price as standard epoxy resin. So there's no reason not to use our stuff. Ooh, was, <laughs> that one. That was a good one. All right.
Thanks, Ray, for hanging out with us, no uh, for letting us invade your space and cruise around. Um, if you want any more information on this stuff, you at home out there on the web, uh, check out our website, www.foamyz.com or Entropy Resins website. Uh, www.entropyresins.com um, Or give us a call at the shop. It was nice meeting you and yeah. Booch. <laughs> All right, thanks for coming up here. Guys. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, Ray. We'll see you, man. See you guys. Uh -oh.